Shalom, this is Prophet Jean. I'm so great to be here. And I would like to thank those who are just uh, watching this video online. Uh, what I want to share with you guys is about prayer. When we say what is the prayer, prayer is the communication between human and God, or between person and God. When you pray, the things can happen that can change others. When you pray, you can never be the same. Because prayer can change a human life. Many people, they just go to church. But they don't know how to pray. You see the scriptures, the, the Bible always just telling us, according to the Bible, Matthew chapter 4, you can say it from chapter 3 to 4, it say, always Jesus went out to the to, to wilderness to pray. And when he was praying, he was praying and passed before God. He was humbling himself to seek the face of God. And after he finished, God gave him authority to start his own work, to, st to start his own ministry. So the Bible said, when if he was finishing the pasting, the devil just came to tempt him. And after that, he just fought and he went through all those temptations. And, you know, he becomes a winner of a devil because he was a winner before and what I'm going to say and to tell every one of you we need to pray you should have your own quiet time you should pray you should seek the God face you should cry before him because when we go to church we are not going to Christ but we are going to receive something from God we are going to receive the blessing we are going to receive our prophecy we are going to receive the word from God we are going to receive what we need before God. So we need to humble ourselves in a prayer because God can work in a prayer when you praise. I mean that you will be the friend of God. If you are the friend of God, God will tell you and show you something because the Bible say, the Bible says that Abraham was the friend of God. The God called Abraham his friend. And if you are praying, God will make you his friend. And he will share every secret to you. So you need to pray. Pray is the most important for a Christian. If you pray, God will change your story. If you pray, God will break the generation curse. If you pray, God will break the weak crop spirit that are following you. Because there is a different spirit that are you know that are working in a bloodline. Because maybe all your grand grand grandfather they just they, they they've been just uh, worshiping the the, the weak crops or the wish doctors. So all those spirits that just follow, that they, they, they follow the, the, the Christian. And if you pray, God will break those spirits and nothing will follow you. They, they, you know, the, you know uh, like God will break the, 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 um, the, 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 the covenant that the devil has made with your family. With your brother and father. Because a lot of people, they can say, my mom, you know, was a Christian and my father was a Christian. And my grandfather was, what about your grand-grandfather? They, 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 they are not a Christian. So you should humble yourself. You should pray and fast before God. And God will break all those spirits who are just waking up to you, who are following you. And you will be free. So, you need to pray. Prayer is not a simple Prayer, you can pray for your family, you can pray for your generation, you can pray for your countries. You can pray for your health. And you can pray and ask God to take you to, the, to the another dimension.
people that are just waiting for the prophet to say something. They are just waiting for the man of God to say something for their life. But they don't know how to, you know, to seek the faith, to seek the God face. They don't know how to humble themselves before God. So everyone has responsibility to pray. It's our word. We need to, we, you know, we need to pray. If you pray, God will change your story. I'm telling you, my friends. We need to seek the God first. We need to pray. We need to pray. We need to pray. Prayer, you know, is, 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 is the most important thing. Because that's what the Bible said. Father, let your will be done as it is in heaven. Which means when we are praying here, we are just doing the will of God that is in heaven. And God will work. He will, will, will provide his miracles through us. The signs and wonder will start to happen. God will reveal his secret to us because the Bible said God can reveal his secret to his people. But whenever you pray, you will receive them. If you are not praying, you can never and ever receive the, the blessing. So I want to tell you that we need to pray. You should arrange your schedule and you should have a quiet time. You can pray before God. And you should break every demonic plant in your family, even, even, even in, 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 in your generation. You should pray for your leaders. You should pray for all the members, for all the Christian and any Christian too. We are, you know, we are the, 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 you know, the, 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 the people that can bring the 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 others out from the bondage because we are called you know to save others as we hear our salvation so we need to pray we need to humble ourselves and when we pray God will open the spirit of revelation and the spirit of knowledge and we will work and preach the will of God. If you are not praying, you cannot do the will of God unless you pray. Will of God can be done through prayer. Will of God can be done in a prayer. If you say, I'm a Christian, but you don't know how to pray, you are not a Christian. Because the Bible says you should follow the full step of Christ. Because Christ is the prayer man. It's the prayer man. He is a prayer man. He can pray always. He can pray without casing. You should pray all the days. You should pray all the way. And you will be the true Christian. When you pray, you can never be stuck. The, the God can break the spirit of limitation. God can break the spirit of curse. God can break, you know, the, 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 the spirit of tried Buddhism. You will see other international. And you will know what you what to do for the future. I want to share this short video for you guys. We need to pray it and we need to put ourselves in a prayer. And I believe if you will do this, your life will never be the same. God will break the curse, God will open all the blazing that have been blocked by devil, and God will achieve your enemy. And God will make you a different. And God will let your enemy to bow down before you when you pray. You just give it up. Start your own quiet time. Start arrange your schedule and pray. I believe God will be with you. If you decided and I believe God will be with you I bless you may God be with you open your mind your soul and your spirit may God reveal yourself unto you in the name of Jesus I break every curse I break every generation curse I break every witchcraft spirit and your bloodline in the name of Jesus I break every spirit of cancer blood fragile and everything that are following your family in mighty name of Jesus Shalom. Thank you so much. Shalom. 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 This is Prophet Jimmy.